Welcome to this short script on how to monitor resources in your TCP IP network using Mainframe Team Center Network Management, the web interface for CA Netmaster Network Management for TCP IP. Use the resource monitor to stay informed of the health of the resources efficiently and to help determine corrective actions when needed. The resource monitor saves you time and effort by eliminating the need to determine the status of resources and stacks by navigating multiple menus and panels, reviewing system messages, and issuing multiple native or system commands. Using the resource monitor, you can check for status deviations at a glance. For example, you can scan or sort the list of resources and check for any resources that are not at the desired status, typically either active or inactive. The resource monitor is essential to monitor efficiently the status of a high number of resources, for example, 100 or more resources. This video shows you how to access the resources page, an overview of the status-related data on that page, state of resources, monitoring or mon status of resources, the meaning of the colors for state and monitoring status, how to sort and pause the display, and how to search the page for items of interest. To access the resources page, log into Mainframe Team Center Network Management and select Monitoring and then Resources. The resources page appears and displays the following status data for IP resources including IP nodes. State, for example, active or degraded. Monitoring or MON status, for example, OK or error. We describe state and monitoring status in detail on the next slide. Name, class, system image, the system image that owns the resource, for example, the LPAR or SMFID. Description of the resource, alert count, time last sampled, and next sample. By default, the display for each resource is updated according to the intervals set in the resource definition. States and monitoring statuses. A resource can be in one of the following states. Active, the resource is active and responds to status display commands. Inactive, the resource is inactive or does not exist on this system. Degraded. One or more resource attributes has returned something other than OK. For example, an attribute preset threshold was exceeded. Unknown. The resource status cannot be determined. For example, it may be being initialized or has not responded to status request commands. A resource can be one of the following monitoring or MON statuses. OK or active. Inactive. Error or failed, SNMP error or timeout, and unknown. Note that some MON status values apply only to certain states. States and MON statuses appear in the same color. Colors and their meanings follow. No color. The state is active and the MON status is either active or OK. Gray. No active alerts. Yellow. Low or severity 4 alert. Light orange. Medium or Severity 3 alert. Dark Orange. High or Severity 2 alert. Red. Critical. Severity 1 alert. Red also can mean that the state is degraded and the MON status is error or failed, for example, for a serious error during data sampling. Turquoise. The state is degraded, but the MON status is not failed or error. If one or more alerts exist for the resource, the color of the highest severity, active alert, is used for the color of the state and MON status. For example, if the highest severity active alert is 2, high, the state and MON status are dark orange. Similarly, if no alerts and no errors exist, the resource is considered active and OK, so the state and MON status have no color. You can also refer to the tooltip help directly on the screen for more details about color, status, and mon statuses. As follows, click the sort icon in a column heading to sort the display alphabetically or numerically, whichever applies, according to the values in that column. Click the sort icon to toggle between ascending and descending order. For example, to sort the display according to the highest number of alerts, click the sort icon in the alert count column. To pause the display, click the pause icon. You can search the display as follows. Use the search field to find text in any column. The search field appears between the main menu and the column display in the middle of the screen. The list adjusts as you type to display only the resources that contain your specified text string. For example, to display only the resources that are in a degraded state, 
enter degraded in the search field. Similarly, to display only the resources of a specific system image, enter the resource name in the search field. Other examples include inactive, DB2, SNMP, and IP node. Note that the number matched field next to the pause icon changes to display the number of resources that match your search criteria. For example, type IP node and note that the field changes to display 21 matched. Use the X button to clear your search criteria and display all resources again. Go to https colon forward slash forward slash docops.ca.com for more product documentation for mainframe team center network management, the web interface for CA Netmaster, network management for TCP IP.